You mind to talk a minute? Was this what you was planning? Be honest, you want it? Come on, get up, I want it. Hands full of innocence, touching you when I sin. Admit it, you've been with it. No witnesses committed. At first, it felt so wrong. They wanted us no more. The love we have held on. There's nothing breaking us up. Steady wanted what we were. Hold me, you're just enough. Let me take your hand and run. Welcome back to our channel, you guys. If you're new, you already know what to do. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Turn on your post notification bell and follow us on our social media. Links will be on the screen and down below in the description. All right, guys. So today, we are bringing back the cooking videos, but we want to yeah. be like unique with it. So as y'all can tell by the title, we will be doing Dorito nachos. Something different. Something different with not just one flavor Dorito. We're going to do what? We have like six? Five. Five. Yeah. Anyways, we got, we're going to show you all the Doritos we're working with, but before we get into that, y'all, if you haven't already, I know it's so early in the video, but go ahead, give the video a thumbs up, and let's get straight to it. And the good thing about this recipe, guys, is that you do not have to be a chef, or, you know, you don't have to know how to cook to make this. It is literally yep. so easy. All you got to do is brown the meat, put the seasoning, melt the cheese, and you're going to be good. So you guys will see all that process. We're going to show you guys. So if you're looking for an easy recipe, but delicious... We're here to bring it to you. And you cannot be that. You cannot be easy and good, okay? Like this thing is so good. Good for Super Bowl snack, good for yes. just good for anything. when you're drinking, when you're Any chilling. day, anything. Right. So babe, let's show them what we're working with. First one we got Doritos Flaming Hot Limon. Second one in the bag. Throw better. We got Doritos Flaming Hot. Can't forget about the Flaming Hot. I think this is gonna be my personal favorite, but you know, we're gonna try it out and see. But you gotta have the spice, okay? Cool Ranch. Who doesn't love a little Doritos Cool Ranch? Regular nacho cheese. This is a classic, so obviously this one's gonna be good. I kind of already know what this one's gonna taste like, so I'm not really interested. You know, you gotta spice up your life a little bit. Last but not least. Last but not least, I don't have to look at it. Spicy nacho. Spicy nacho. So, babe, which one do you think is gonna be your favorite? Because I already told him mine. I'm not trying to be biased, y'all. Um, my favorite flavor when it comes to Dorito nachos is the spicy nacho. Bias. No, I'm not trying to be biased in any way. I just Bias. feel like this is gonna be be it. I don't know about you, but we need to get to cooking, we need to baby. Make it do what it do. Let's do what it do. All right, y'all. We are bringing back glasses tree tree. Hey, your glasses is good. Like you, you're cute to me. You look like a sexy. Babe, I'm not you look like a you. sexy. Okay, babe, but okay, listen though. You look like cute a is what you call like jigglypuff. <laughs> babe, I'm saying you look like a sexy like teacher or something. I don't know, baby. You might oh have to God. teach me some things. All right, guys. So first off, we have Velveeta cheese, obviously for our nacho cheese. We got queso blanco. So first, you're gonna wanna put her in the pot and let her melt. By the way, her hands are clean, y'all. We washed our hands before this. Yeah. So we're just gonna start with half, y'all. You know, just to, hold on, let me cut it up so it can melt faster. But we're gonna start with half, just to, um, you know, make sure we don't make too much and just like waste it or whatever. So we're gonna start with half. Yeah, uh, cooking, cooking, cooking. Okay, wipe the sweat, wipe the sweat, wipe the sweat, wipe the sweat. Y'all, so we got this wavy onions. I mean, oh, we, we got the good. Lay's wavy onions onion flavor. And um, I don't know, y'all. Let me see what the hype is about because everyone's saying it's good. So let me see. Ooh. Let me try. Because I love onions. Um, so funny. Yo, I love try. onions too, but I don't know how I feel about these. But let's, let's see. Mmm, this is good. Yo, this is really good. Bye. <laughs> All right, guys. So we got the cheese in the, on the stove. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and put it on. Oh shoot, that's the wrong stove. Look at me. I'm already tripping out. Okay, so we're gonna put it on high until, you know, I start to see some melting going on. And then I'll lower it to like medium. Y'all can use whatever kind of meat y'all want. You, you can use um ground beef, but you know, me and my wife are using ground turkey. Um, ground turkey, it's, don't be, don't be like intimidated by ground turkey. Oh, ground turkey is actually really good. It just feels lighter when you eat it. So I got my little, you know, 
handy dandy handy dandy frying pan handy dandy panty um and i'm gonna use it to you know put this so like brown turkey is kind of like kind of like dry in a way because it doesn't have that like natural Fatty, fat like yeah. so i'm gonna go ahead put some olive oil whoa look at that cheese she's making noise already as you guys can see she's starting to melt down there so give her some time Babe, stop eating that. You're gonna lose your appetite. You know, we got five different kinds of Doritos to try back here. I know, babe, but this is so good. Like, Oh my goodness. You might as well try that with the thing too. Sponsor me. Sponsor me with this exact same flavor. <laughs> and the back says too that they're coming out with Cheetos and Dorito flavor. Really? Mm-hmm. Damn. So good, y'all. Not sponsored, but get you one because it's really good. We're just gonna use these um, simple taco seasoning. You know, we figure why not. Use a taco seasoning for nachos. Okay, now the ground turkey is going in. We're probably gonna just use the whole thing. I mean, Kevin can just eat the leftover. He loves making himself like nachos and all that stuff. So, so right now, all I'm doing is just pretty much cooking down the um, ground turkey and then i'm gonna end up putting like seasonings and then the taco seasoning and okay babe so how's how's the cheese looking over there babe because my ground turkey she's doing good she's looking cute she's looking oozy woozy so my wife ended up having to put a little bit more cheese because when it started to melt it didn't look like it was much especially for like this amount of ground beef i mean um i'm probably gonna honestly turkey. put the whole thing in there especially because we have this much like... yeah like i said this is not going to waste we're actually doing like this video but it's not gonna go to waste because um Mr. Miller loves, aka Kevin, aka Kevin, aka Trina's mom's boo thing. He loves nachos. Like I'm not even joking, y'all. So, shoot, he's gonna have everything. He's gonna be so happy because he's gonna have all of these leftovers. Mm -hmm. This cheese is looking extra cheesy. She's currently getting the dishes. We're gonna lay out the chips, but before we get that, babe, you need to cut the veggies, cause um, more veggies. Oh, yes. Yeah, so my wife's just gonna shred up the lettuce. I'm gonna sit, take care of the ground turkey, and this is like. So fast, so fast, so easy, and so good. You wanna wash your lettuce, guys. Don't forget to wash your veggies. So I'm actually gonna cut it first and then um, throw it in the strainer and wash it. But y'all, when we went to the store, they did not have shredded lettuce, so we gotta, we gotta- Go old school with it. Mm -hmm. Yep, we gotta make it do what it do. We gotta improvise, and it's totally fine because this is the same thing, you know, all I gotta do is cut it good. Yeah. I'm over here on the side, y'all, I'm gonna feel like the excess oil coming out from the brown turkey because I don't want no oily, you know, nachos. Brown turkey is pretty much done. I'm gonna lower the heat and then I'm gonna start seasoning. I'm gonna go ahead and start with some black pepper. And then I'm gonna go ahead and pour the taco seasoning. I'm gonna go with one first because you know, you don't wanna go OD and then it's just too much. So I'm gonna see what See what this one pack is all about. Okay, so clearly I need the other pack because um that's not enough. Do have. Oh my gosh, it's smelling like Taco Tuesday right now. We're gonna use a good amount of parsley, and then we're also gonna use a little bit of uh, Italian seasoning. The update on the cheese. It's almost there, y'all. She's like 90% done. All right, guys. So now we're gonna do a quick taste test with the ground turkey. Let me mm. try. Mm. So good, it made me wanna slap somebody. She's forgetting about me, y'all. Mm. Mm. Babe, I feel like That's we're about good. to have some taco right mm. now. Like, this is so good. I might just, just That's really good, eat the whole damn pot. Wow, that's really good. Time to plate, guys. Time, time to plate. plate. I'm excited. It's time to plate. So we have the lettuce here all washed and clean. Got the cheese going on. And you know we had to get the meat, y'all. First, we're gonna go with the Cool Ranch. So open her up. And spill the whole thing on the plate. Ooh. There we go. We got all that seasoning, one for the rope. A little ASMR for y'all. All right, baby, so what are we going with next? We have the flaming Hot Doritos. Ooh, this one should be good. I love, y'all already know we love our spice. Mm. She's looking extra red today. One for the roll, baby, here you go. Spicy nacho. I'm excited, really though. I'm really excited to try it. Just show them the variety of colors so yeah, far. Yeah, we got the yellow looking one. We got the red, red one. We got the dark orange one. And what's next, babe? Regular nacho So cheese. we go with the regular orange. 
This is somewhat lighter than the spicy yeah. napa. Yeah, you can tell, look at that. And then last, last but not, not least, least, limon. I don't know how I feel about that, because you know I don't like like lemony flavored snacks. I love snacks. lemony flavored snacks, but I don't know how it'll taste like with the cheese and stuff. That's my yeah. only thing. All right, guys, so that's what we have. We got all the Doritos laid out. Now we're about to fix the plates. Y'all right. could honestly layer it how you want. Right now, we're gonna go with ground turkey first. Oh yeah, baby, get it everywhere. Put some of that meat on there. Yes, ma'am. Yes. I want to grab every single thing when I pull one chip. Go next. Oh, y'all, this pan is so key heavy. Like my arm is uh, she kind of getting uh, kind of getting tired over here. I'm so excited for this, y'all. Like you have no idea. I love me some nachos, so I know this is gonna be good. And look how easy it was, guys. You can literally make this at home, whether you cook or not. You know what I mean? It's my favorite part, baby. Get to my favorite part. Now we got the cheese goo going. That, oh my goodness. All right, guys, so now we're just gonna top her off with a little bit of lettuce, not too crazy, cause you know, you wanna taste the, you wanna taste the thing. I want a good amount on there though. And you could literally add whatever you want to it, salsa, sour cream. We have some sauce in there that I need to get. Um, and some hot sauce, definitely gonna add some hot sauce. All right guys, so we're just trying to stay away from spice for now, for a little bit, so I'm gonna use this um, mild sauce right here. Go ahead and drizzle it on there. Oh my gosh, this looks so good. All right guys, so we're gonna go ahead and do a taste test. Finally. Um, what are you gonna start with? I think we should start with the same exact thing. This one. I'm gonna put hot sauce in Well, let's go do the plain first. This is the plain, that's the, that's the spicy nacho. Hot sauce. Mmm. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh my god. That wow. is so good. I'm gonna take another one. Wow, that is really good. And like the flavors keep coming. Mm -hmm. It keep coming. It keeps coming and coming. Wow, that is so good, y'all. Wait, is this regular? Mm-hmm. Wow. Guys, this is a, a hit, okay? Like I said, wow, try yeah. it. Try it at home, it's not that expensive. All right. Mm. But you choose. Mm -mm -mm. Yo, we weren't supposed to film. This was like a last minute thing. That's why we're like, looking how we're looking right now. We're actually chilling all day. And I was like, let's film like nachos since I'm craving for it. So what, good. what are you going for next? Okay, so this is the flaming Hot. Are you not gonna one. try it at all? No, I'm gonna try it. I'm just saying this is the, the hot one. This was the hell yeah, y'all. So. Yeah, that one was really good. Okay. Now time for the flaming hot, guys. The one I think is gonna be my favorite. Okay, let me grab a good piece, cause um. Okay, ready? Mm-hmm. Mm. -hmm. Mm. That's good. Wow, that's good. Mm. Mm mm mm. Mm hmm. Wow, that's really good. That's better. That's better than the first one, for sure. Mmm. They're both so good, but the flaming Hot so far is better than that one. Mm. Wow. All right, let's move on to the the spicy nacho one. So spicy nacho. Mm-hmm. Okay. I'm gonna need some. I'm gonna wait. Hold on. I need, I need a, a middle piece. piece. Yeah. Get the middle piece like this. Oh yes. Look at this one. Ooh. Oh Lord, hold on, cause I'm having a hard time trying to get me a good piece with everything on it. Okay, there it is. Wow, that's, Cheers, that's gonna be a big bite. Mmm. Mm hmm. They're literally all so good. And the queso blanco, better than cheddar. Better than regular cheese. Try it with queso blanco. I'm telling you, it makes all the difference. Mm hmm. Okay, next we're gonna try Cool Ranch. Okay, I have a good piece right here. I'm gonna go ahead and try it. Ooh. Okay, Cool Ranch. Wow. Is it not as good? It's just like eating tacos. Like, it literally, it's like eating tacos with like a ranch flavor on it. Not a mm -hmm. wow for me. I mean, if that's the only chips I have to do nachos with, I'll do it. Okay, mm -hmm. now. Okay, y'all, this one was all right. Um, it was all right. It wasn't. Yeah. I wouldn't, this would not be my initial choice. But if, if it's the only chip you have to do nachos with, yeah. you do it. Yeah. I think it's because it's kind of like regular um, Tostitos chip. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, this is the one I'm kind of excited for. 
I don't know what to expect from this. Let me just put some meat on here. Put some lettuce on my lips. Whew, here it goes. Lemon, y'all. Not for me. You don't like it? I don't like the lemony, the lemony like flavor. No, I don't like that. Mm -hmm. I like it. Here, wait, you can have this. This is why I don't mm -hmm. like Takis and stuff. I don't like lemon flavored chips. I'll have this one though. I don't agree with that. I'm gonna have this one. Yeah. I told y'all, my favorite one is the spicy nachos and I wasn't being biased. I just felt like it was gonna be I thought be you so like good. this. No, that's good. Like if I had to choose my top two, it'd be this and then that. But um. Guys, this lemon is, is pretty good too, but yeah. I think the lime flavor kind of like throws it away. Throws it off for me big time. Like I don't, I don't really like it's it. It's still good though, don't get me wrong, but I'm gonna switch back to this one. This is really good too though. Yo, I think we're gonna have to end this video now. Mm. Because um, we're gonna be sitting here grubbing and um, yeah. All right guys, we're gonna go ahead and end this video right here right now so we can just enjoy this off camera. But 10 out of 10, definitely recommend. Mm -hmm. Spicy nacho or flaming Hot or regular nacho is the best. So yeah, go ahead and try it with whatever um, Dorito flavor that you like or whatever chips you like. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Let us know what else you wanna see us cook. If you do enjoy these cooking videos, follow us on all of our social medias. It will be on the screen as well as in the description below. And shout out the day goes to whom I love. Dorito nachos. <laughs> Shout out to Doritos, y'all. Sponsor your girls because we love Doritos. Doritos is like my favorite snack. No, I'm just kidding. Shout out the day goes to ZR. Shout out to you. Thanks so much for the love and support. And to everyone else, we cannot thank y'all enough. True Train Riri, we love you guys. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Peace and God bless. You mind it talk a minute? Was this what you was planning? Be honest, you want it. Come on, get up, I want it. Hands full of innocence.